Coach, what a game, what an effort. You must be pleased. Yeah, yeah, really pleased. Uh, we talked about having that killer in instinct there, holding the two-goal lead. And after, you know, the unfortunate events of, of last Saturday against Niagara and, um, you know, against a real good offensive team, uh, I thought our guys really bought in to the defensive side of the puck and, um, you know, really got the job done here. What was different? It seemed the forwards paid a little bit more attention to their play in their own end. Was... Yeah, I mean, hey, like... There's learning pieces from every game, and, and certainly for us, um, the big learning curves have been um, holding leads and um, committing to defending, really, as a group. And um, I thought that was evident tonight in our play and a uh, big reason why we won. We just heard from uh, the new player, Connor Toms. What did you think of his performance? Yeah, he was great. Um, you know, experienced guy, um, competes hard. Uh, I thought he was, you know, really solid tonight for us back there. and kind of a steady presence. I thought all the D were really good, um, to be honest. They're solid as a group and, uh, you know, moving pucks pretty quick and defending hard. And, um, yeah, I thought they were great. Is this a prototypical game of how the Spitfires will win? You don't get a lot of shots. You capitalize on your opportunities and then you try to outwork the opponent. Is that yeah, I still think, like, the shot totals, yeah, some a uh, few of our games have been down. Like, I feel like we're being a little too unselfish around the net sometimes. And I think we can work on that, like, you get inside that scoring area, like there's times to shoot it and, and it can create a rebound or obviously, you know, uh, better yet, it can go in. But, um, and I think we missed the net a little bit, but, you know, uh, hey, listen, like it, it's, uh, it's a huge win for our team against a really good team. And, um, you know, obviously we'll take that all day long. Hi, I'm Dan Jemis, CEO of the Dan Jemis Real Estate Team. When you think real estate in Windsor and Essex County, think of the Dan Jemis Team. We're here to help every step of the way. Learn more at danjemis.com. Connor, welcome to Windsor, and uh, what a great start. You got the victory. Uh, what did you think about your performance tonight? Yeah, it was good. Um, I thought the team played really well, and it was, uh, it was a great welcome to the team. How did you play? How did you think you played? Uh, I thought I played pretty good. I uh, moved pucks up well. Um, I thought I got out of the zone pretty good and uh, defended well. So, yeah. When did you get to win after the trip? Um... That day, I was actually up here, stayed in a hotel for a night, and then practiced the next morning with the team. Okay, and so you knew the trade was coming, or...? Yeah, I knew it was coming, so I uh, got ready, packed all my stuff, and now I'm here. What about it? You're a Sioux boy, you get traded to Windsor from the Sioux. Yeah. What are your thoughts on the deal? Yeah, it's, uh, they're arch rivals, but I'm just super excited to be here, and I have a good opportunity here, and I'm just really happy. Going into the game tonight, how did the coaches prepare you for it? Did they try to ease you into it, or did you jump in head first? Um, the coaches really good. Uh, they got me up to date with the systems and everything. Uh, we played pretty similar to Sue, so it was kind of a smooth transition. But uh, yeah, it was uh, pretty easy. The coaches and teammate, my teammates helped a lot. Pretty good game out there, physical game. You're playing a high-powered offense. Um, just talk about the way you guys played against their attack. Uh, yeah, I thought we uh, took away their time and space for the most part. Obviously, uh, there's some good players, so they got some opportunities. But I thought for the most part, we did a good job of uh, limiting their chances for sure. Did you get another Martin skin at the end of the game there? Yeah, he gave me a whack, so uh, I had to retaliate there. That's great. Very good debut. What do you think you bring to this team? Stability on the back end coming going forward? Yeah, um... I'm a 19-year-old player now, so I've been around the league, so definitely some stability and uh, uh, limiting their chances and helping out the young guys for sure. I mean, that last minute, I don't think you're expecting to make your debut and, and be out there in the last minute in the one-goal game, or were you? Yeah, I don't It's just how the game went. Uh, I was super happy to be out there, though, and I'm glad we got the win. What do you get? What's the impression you get? I mean, you, you've gotten to watch this team now, your, own, your new team now for a game. What's the impression you get from that group? Uh, yeah, the, the Windsor? Yeah. Yeah, um, great team, uh, great group of guys. They were super welcoming at the start. Uh, some really good players, very fast, very fast, very skilled. And uh, yeah, it's all kind of coming together now. It's that, you've always enjoyed that nice six hour ride from the Sioux back to Windsor. I mean, how's it feel to have to turn it around and go <laughs> right back up to Windsur? Yeah, it's a quick turnaround, but I'm excited to be back in the Sioux and uh, play against my former team. You're never too old to play in the mud. The only thing that changes are the toys.